I got a new mouse. I chose the Basilisk Hyperspeed because as some of you have noticed, I've got slightly larger hands than average. But I still want a light mouse for making quick video edits so I can pump out those weekly videos that I'm known for. I wanted a Bluetooth mouse to use with my laptop, but it's got a 2.4G receiver too. The receiver is going to be plugged into my desktop, so we can deduct that. The biggest weight saving is going to be the AA battery. Using an adapter, we can use a much lighter AAA battery in its place. The AAA will still last several months. But first, I need to wish my friend a happy birthday. It's PCBWay's 9th anniversary. You know, the place where you can still get 10 custom circuit boards for $5. Except this birthday, they're giving you the gifts. With free coupons on their awesome services, including up to 50% off 3D printing and CNC machining. If you're like me, you'll feel like a kid in a candy store. There's never been a better time to bring your idea to life. So click the link in the description and start making today. The battery stays in just fine on its own, so this holder is superfluous. I'm going to leave these metal screws though, as this magnetic latching is just too satisfying. I'll carefully take off the bottom sticker and skates to access the screws. Look at all that superfluous plastic that can be harvested. Just so superfluous. The mouse buttons are clipped in place, but also plastic welded, so I won't be removing them. I want to retain the borders for the skates, so I mark them out on the inside so I don't drill through them. One down, several more to go.
was going to leave this back plate untouched, but the desire for more yield was too great. I can still remove plastic from underneath the buttons, as long as I'm careful not to drill all the way through. Looks pretty good, but how much does it weigh? I got it down to just 90 gra... Not 90 grams. Now I can whip those fast edits. Yeah, it's fine. Alright, <laughs> <laughs> 